tell you a story about my boss, Sheldon Leonard. Sheldon Leonard, uh, this, this, is a, this is a true story. Sheldon Leonard is a man that hired me for high spy. He brought me up to his office. He said, I want you to be a spy. I said, okay. So we signed a contract and the series was on, was a hit. I don't complicate anything, man. <laughs> so, uh, Sheldon was married a long time ago, probably before there was hair. <laughs> He's an old bugger, he's, a, he's really old, Duke. And uh, he took his wife on a honeymoon up to Niagara Falls, and this was when Niagara Falls was brand new. Uh, they didn't even give you a raincoat or nothing, you know. He just stood there, you got wet, and you came down, you smiled at each other, you know. And he said, he tells this story. He said, it was very cold that day, but the following morning, the sun came out, and it shone brightly and the temperature went up to 99. So I said to my bride, bride, why don't we take a little dip in the wonderful lake? And his bride looked at us, yes, shall. Yeah, they talk a lot. <laughs> I believe we should. And he did. Went forth, put on his bathing suit, his beautiful body, which has since gone bad on him. <laughs> and he went stepping with his little 4'11 wife. Frankie's beautiful, she's just 4'11, just built like regular little wife. <laughs> and he went walking, got to the edge of the lake, and it was 99 out. And he said, my dear, I believe I shall take a plunge. That's the way they used to talk in the old days, you know. They, you had to tell your wife everything you are gonna do, you know, even if she was standing there looking at you, you know. My dear, I believe I will walk to this board. Do it, do it. I said, are you with me? She said, yes, Sheldon, I'm with you. And he went up and he hit the diving board. And he did soar into the air. Up, 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 forming a great swan dive. Yes. <laughs> now, we will pause a second, leave our hero stranded in the air. We'll hold him, don't worry about it. He won't drop, he's still up there. And we will say, he is about to plunge into a what? Lake. Aha, uh -huh. and how do you get lake water? Well, usually what happens is the water runs down from the mountain. Yes, and how do you get it? Maybe the snow will melt. Right, does it ever really get hot? No. And so he is about to dive into what? 12 degrees. <laughs> now we pick up our hero at the peak of his swan. And he is now descending and he's coming down and boosh, he hit the water. And immediately he said, my body, turned into a giant goose pimple. <laughs> and as I submerged, my eyes would not close because they too wanted to know what had hit them. <laughs> my body began to drop into a ball. I touched bottom, thank goodness, and pushed up. And as my head broke through the water, I was facing my wife about 30 feet away from her. And she stood there smiling. And I said to myself, why should I tell her? <laughs> so I gathered every inch, every muscle, and I smiled. And I said to her, come on in, dear. The water's fine. And she hit the board <laughs> and made a great swan. And when she came down, the tips of her fingers touched the water. And she made one of the greatest hand walks across the lake <laughs> any man has ever seen. And stood on the other side and yelled great obscenities to me. So that's Sheldon's play. Thank you.